I'm getting closer. I should get bonus points for that, right? Sure, and maybe one of the bad guys should just lie down because you almost shot him. Yeah, Chris Keller was thinking he'd be more of a lookout, like kind of hang back and offer moral support from afar. What about you, Julian? You just want to hang back and offer moral support too? No. Jeez. You sure you thought this thing through, Keller? What's that supposed to mean? You say you want to help Haley. You have a thing for her. You have since high school. So? So from where I stand, this is a lose-lose for you. If you don't bring Nathan back, you failed her. If you do, you lose her anyway. Once Nathan comes home, you're out of the picture. So are you. Yeah. Haley told me all about it. Once Nathan comes back, you lose your family. So from where I'm standing, it's worse for you. Because I lose what I never had, but you had it. Your son, your grandkids, all of it. But here we are. What about you, Baker? What's your role in all this? Nathan's my friend. Not really. I'd say he's more of an acquaintance. Nobody's gonna lay down their life for an acquaintance. Is this still about you leaving your kids in the car? No. I need to believe that there's still justice, that even now in a world full of gray and spin and compromise, and if you choose to do wrong and you prey on good people when you do, someone will stand up to you. Someone will take a stand and fight back. Nathan's a good man. Deserves a good life. Oh! <laughs> Yo, I want one of those. Keep practicing. And then what? We wait until dark. Then we fight back.